Hi, I'm Joe Hildebrand, and I'm dumb, drunk and racist. Why? Because I'm an Australian. You see, we Australians don't have the greatest reputation overseas. It made Australia look like the land that time forgot. I mean, the Australians are basically English rednecks, you know? But it seems there's one country that has a worse view of us than any other. India. Australia is a racist country. There is nothing secular or non-racial about them. Worse still, many Indians believe they're not even physically safe here. It seems that there has been another racist attack against another Indian. It was three Indians versus 80 Australians. 50 officially registered attacks in six months. They've probably forgotten that India has a nuclear bomb and they don't. Thousands of Indian call centre workers phone us every day. What's your long distance and phone calls? Some have been taught Australians are dumb, drunk and racist. Okay. Why would that be? But at least we're good sports, right? The problem with the Australians is they're very, very bad losers. They treat a sports field like a battlefield. But why should we care what the Indians think of us? Well, for one thing, it's costing us money. Education is one of our biggest export earners, and Indian students don't want to come here anymore. We like Australia, yes. but Australians don't like us. That's yes. what it comes yeah. to. There's a disconnect between how the Indians see us and how we see ourselves. We reckon we're a bunch of good blokes in the land of the fair go. They think we're a bunch of rednecks in a land of racists. So who's right and who's wrong? To find out, I'm taking four Indians on a road trip around Australia. There's Mahima, a call centre worker. They do say, like, you bloody Asians, you fuck off. Amir, a university student. You're going to get beaten up. You're an Indian. They beat up Indians. Radhika, an education advisor. Right now, we don't recommend Australia to students too much. Too much in the sense, not at all. And Gamit, an anchorman on a major Hindi news network. The Australian government should set a precedent in front of people that, yeah, we have made a law that will hang the people who will attack the Indian people. I'll be introducing them to the good. Delicious. It's beautiful. The bad. You fucking whop, fucking guinea it's bastard. Insane. There you go. Quite fraud, motherfuckers. And the bogan. <laughs> of my own country. <laughs> we'll discover through their eyes whether all these nasty stereotypes about Australians are true. It's not every day you meet such a bunch of idiots. Gentlemen, step right up. Abuse an Indian call centre worker. And we might even learn a few things about ourselves. Australia has shoved this subject so deep under the carpet that we find it hard to even think about it. Let's don't say anything. There'll be desolation. Infatuation. Yes. Um, you want to be? And maybe even some revelations. Are we really a nation of dumb, drunk racists? Find out.